Okay, so you open the door to the next area, bust out your sniper rifle, and you're gonna kill one of these scions before you run down there. You can only see the side of him, so it's gonna take like five or six shots to kill him. Compared to the two or three if you're getting headshots. Uh huh. But as soon as you start to walk down those stairs, like immediately in front of you, there's a second scion, and there's gonna be a shitload of husks that are gonna come running after you. So it looked like it took me six shots there to kill him. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, six. Change weapon. Um, I was counting by the I can see by the counting. spikes in the waveform for the audio track on this video. Anyway, nerd, nerd shut the fuck up. <laughs> um, but yeah, those scions are a bitch. There's gonna be a bunch of husks running from my left, Ugh, or no, on the God. right actually. The husks come from the left later on. Um, so. Yeah, just focus on that Scion at the start if you can. Um, and then whip out your shotgun and start shooting all the husks that are coming at you. I really don't like the shotgun. It's not a very good gun. Um, it might be fun to run around with it on the easier difficulties, but on whatever this difficulty is called, extreme. Extreme! Uh, <laughs> it's just not that effective. You have to be so close to these guys to do enough damage. Like, the closer you are to an enemy, regardless of what gun you're using, mm -hmm. it does more damage. Hmm. So, if you're point blanking a dude with a sniper rifle There's the or a shotgun, it's beneficial. No scoping? No scoping. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> sure. Um, so, run around, pick up some ammo, get any collectibles that are laying around the area. Even though there's no missable collectible, it's just some extra cash, I think. And in a second, you're going to hack this ter terminal, which is going to activate the next couple waves of bad guys. 